I learned about All Women Count as a nurse. Um, that was one of my main things to do as a clinic nurse, uh, to make sure that the patients know um, that it's available to them, to get them enrolled, and to work with the All Women Count staff to make sure that the patients are covered um, in the clinic setting and then moving forward um, if they needed specialty care. I really took it upon myself to make sure that it was being utilized to the maximum that we could do because you know it saves the clinic money too for staff to know that it's okay to you know give the form to everybody to at least attempt to enroll anyone is I think that's important and it's just not something that a lot of people are aware of it's just one extra form it really is not that big of a deal and it's kind of a no-brainer to just give them a form it's something like even the front desk could hand them if they know they're coming in for a pap smear or they're going to have a mammogram just give them the form and you know if the patient doesn't want to fill it out you know they don't have to fill it out the all women count people they communicate with the billing office and with us to make sure that they have all of the test results and everything um, covered and so the woman just keeps going through her appointments until they reach an answer whether it's you know it's non-cancerous or it is cancerous so until um, the woman reaches that verdict she doesn't really have to think about anything else as far as you know filling out more forms or submitting any billing or anything all of account really takes care of all of that and then you know a few years later if they go to get their next pap smear they just re-enroll it doesn't hardly take any time at all and I just I can't get over how easy it is I mean yeah it's a few extra minutes but in the grand scheme of things that's you know you could be saving somebody's life